There it is guys, the new rescue rig. 1989, 3500. When I worked at a body shop in 1990, the foreman bought this truck brand new. And I remember this truck. And when I ran into him, and he said he was thinking of selling it, I shook his hand and said, I'll take it. And I hadn't seen it since 19, 1991, maybe 93. But what a beautiful truck. Jen, of course, is like, what's, what's, what are they hiding? Not hiding anything, honey. Bruce just took care of this truck. So this is the eight foot bed extended cab. See, we got pop out windows. That's good. Running boards. I'm still, I'm missing a couple of the original rims. I know he has them. Will I leave the cap on? I don't know. Part of me wants to leave this truck just as Bruce had it. Will I take the bug shield off? Maybe. So the 8889s had those offset headlights, I believe. I think 90s got the flush. Correct me if I'm wrong. So what's under the hood? Come on now. You guessed it. 7.4. Four, five, four. The big dog. You can also see he coated the frame and everything, which I love. Totally took care of this truck. Got the dual battery set up on this. Yes, sir. I think the only truck bigger than this they offered was the Mel Gibson edition, the dually. And uh, that was probably a 454 as well. 7.4 just never understood those battery terminals how's the engine oil ready for a change do a tune up on this thing i forgot to mention we shook hands on this and i didn't even see the truck or know how many miles are on it but he hooked me up on it, so I lucked out when he told me I had 50 something thousand miles. That was a sigh of relief. <laughs> but as you can see, it's in fantastic condition. So we'll do a tune up on this. You guys drop a comment. I don't know too much about these, these engines. So distributor cap, plugs, air cleaner, oil change. Something else I need to look, look out for on these. Please drop a comment and let me know. Low miles can be a good thing and a bad thing. You know, they sit. Is it is it me? Or does the front tire stick out on this? Yeah, it totally does. That's weird. Huh. You got wheel spacers on there, I wonder. Of sticks out what a nice truck huh things in beautiful condition really not a cap guy I'm just not I got an oil filter brake pads oh, it looks like he's got all oh he's got plugs in it's like he was getting ready to do it got plugs to bring all this inside Let's see what we have so there's the original rims I'm willing to bet those are the original tires must be huh We'll have to get the other two steelies from him. What else have we got in there? I forgot all about this. I was gonna order all this. Uh, I was gonna order all this stuff from Rock Auto today. So we'll go. Th I'll go through that. I'll get the parts ordered. You guys, let me know in the comments what I should get. Got the tow package. I have the window sticker for this truck. It's a uh, 342 rear axle. So. That's about it. I just wanted to show you the new, oh, ashtray. Those must be our uh, fog lights. 
So we do have a little bad news on the truck. There's a noise coming from, I believe, the driver's side valve cover. I don't know if it's lifters, if it's a uh, manifold crack, I'm not sure. So let's fire this thing up. I'll give you guys a listen. Maybe you guys can help me identify it and we can try and fix it in the next video. So let's check it out. Oil pressure looks good. Got a brake light on too. That doesn't look good. You guys let me know what you think. I gotta shut this thing off. I mean, that's a lot of smoke. Well, it is cold, but that looked like an awful lot of smoke. What do you guys think? You guys let me know. I appreciate it. I I haven't heard it in a while because I've had this truck for a little while, but I was thinking it had some tapping over here and I was thinking it was lifters, maybe a manifold. And now it seemed like the noise was over here, whether it was like a pulley. I mean, maybe it was just a fan. I don't know. It didn't sound like uh Lower end rod knock. That what is that? Is that old? What is this? That's <laughs> Bueller. Bueller. Anyone? So that's the new tow rig. Josh and I will be using. Hopefully in the spring we'll be riding some motocross. Eight foot bed. Plenty of room for everything. Close the tailgate. I love it. Gas mileage. Not so much. So let me know on the engine what you guys think moving forward. It's been sitting, I don't even know, he hasn't driven it in a, in a while. So additives for the oil, flush, give me your opinion, I appreciate it. So thank you guys for dropping in, I appreciate it, and we'll see you soon. Take care guys.